coming up next, it's a UFC featherweight division fight. UFC DC this man has put on a striking clinic and that is his methodology coming in here tonight He'll try to keep the fight on the feet. and that's why we tune in right? That's why we tune in we tune in to see guys that are dynamic We tune in for the speed we tune in for the knowledge of the striking game the ability to set traps the ability to find the jab the ability to find the right hand the right kick the left kick the knees the elbows he truly uses every weapon that he has in his arsenal to try and finish his opponent. You make one mistake, night's over. You cannot make mistakes against a guy that has the striking acumen yep. of this guy right here. And the jab is not as underutilized a weapon as it was in MMA, say, five or seven years ago, but he's got as good a jab as anyone in the business, and that is where all of his striking flows off of. We'll see how it goes for him in this matchup tonight. Well, you can argue this is the most influential martial artist of all time, the great Bruce Lee, making his walk to the octagon here tonight, Jim. Everybody wants to be Bruce Lee. They say they want to be like Mike. If you're a fighter, you want it to be like Bruce Lee. You want it to be that fast. You want it to be that charismatic. You want it to have an ability to just freeze your opponents. Your speed, your movement, just the diversity in the attacks that you can give your opponents would just confuse people. I mean, I watched him beat a seven foot three method to bar to stay undefeated. Right. If you could do that, you could do anything. I fear not the man who has practiced 10,000 kicks once, but I fear the man who has practiced one kick 10,000 times, Bruce Lee, in a nutshell. Just so wise. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Eve Loving. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold out Madison Square Garden Arena in New York City. UFC featherweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet nine inches tall, weighing in at 137 pounds. Fighting out of Mexico City, Mexico, Bazooka. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds, fighting out of Los Angeles, California, USA, Bruce the Dragon Lee. Okay, protect yourself at all time, will be my command at all time. If you want to touch love, do it now, go back to your corner. So here we go with the start of round one. I can tell how excited you are for this matchup. Seems to be a striking advantage on one side, but maybe this is a big time fight. It feels like a big moment for both of these guys' careers. Who is going to be able to implement their game plan the best in this matchup between these two big time athletes? Let those hands go. Lee gets caught with that punch. His chin is held up thus far. Got to shore up the defense here, though. Perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Just missed on the front kick there. Oh, the kickboxing chops on full display with that offering nicely done. Beautiful kick landed by this man.
big punch lands over the top. Ultimate follows. Just missed with the leg kick. It's very tricky when he throws that body kick. Fighters exchange in the pocket here. Oh! oh! Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. And he comes through with a big knee. Oh, huge block! Nice punch land over the top. Oh, he got that inside leg kick to the target there, DC. You don't want to eat too many of those. No, you can't. It starts to beat up the inside thigh. That is a technique. Top, and now his opponent in a world of trouble. Beautiful level change. Make him think you're going low and you come right over the top with that beautiful overhand. Great punch. All right, so a nice shot there defensively to raise the guard and prevent any damage. Those hands never leave where they're supposed to be. And if you do that, most times you will block the shot that's incoming. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. Just unable to quite find that range. Out of the lead leg there, DC. He is chopping up that leg. They say chop down the tree. You beat your opponent by slowing him down first with those nice outside leg kicks. Punch coming, it's blocked. And he connects there with a punch, so pretty good striking display by him thus far. He throws everything so straight and so accurate. Oh, nice jab. Both fighters hanging down in the pocket and both landing. All right, he engages in a single collar tie here. Try to get out of Muay Thai. Five minutes in the books. Great job last night. Had him hurt. Almost finished. Look at him on the stool. He's still wobbling. This round. All right, now we take a look back at some of the highlights. He has had his kicking game going early and often tonight. I mean, on point, right? He knew that this was going to be a way for him to take control of this fight. He's used those kicks to really put him out ahead. And I'm not sure if his opponent has the ability to adjust and stop him from landing these over and over. All right, here we go as our next round gets underway. His strong leg acts so much power that even when he doesn't throw it full throttle, you see he's able to inflict damage. We'll see if he can keep it going here in this he round. He doesn't throw it full power, but even when he faints it, he draws out reactions from his opponents because they don't want to get hit with any more of those kicks. It's a sight to behold. Nice punch there. 
All right, so he's landed some good shots tonight, but this is not a combo meal, right? No three-piece, no. no soda. It's one and done more often than not. John, don't you come to me without a combo. I want the <laughs> whole platter. Give him the whole platter, young man. Put some punches together. Make this guy take the whole thing. Give him more than one strike. You have now found the set of punch. The jab is landing consistently. Find something that's going to go behind it. Oh, looking to land the leg kick, but unable to find the target. Head kick. Back to his patented kicks here, but just out of range. High crush, baby. High crush. Give him a high crush. Nice kick. Loaded up like right now, too. Trying to kick the leg out. That's a big strike right there. Straight right, he misses. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Oh, Superman punches good. You can tell he's been working on that. Came of inches right I'm there, boy. You. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Oh, just misses with the kick. Nice combination there by Lee. Strike there by Lee. Put your well, he has really picked up the pace here in round two. Much more aggressive than we saw in round one, and now starting to find himself in the pocket. Overhand right, swing and a miss. Just misses with the jab. Well, eventually, you know he's going to turn this defense into offense, but he's certainly doing a nice job on the defensive end muscle. They talk about the feeling out process. He's getting his opponent's timing. Now he's blocking everything. Expect counters as we go forward. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Tonight, DC connected with it there. He's thrown so many left jabs to throw that right punch straight down the pipe. It's unreal. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes up. Nice. Oh, a little single collar tie there. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Swing and a miss by Lee. Look at him drive his shin into his opponent's body with that body kick. Whiffs on the straight right hand. Lee going for the body, miss with that kick. They continue to exchange. 20 seconds left. Well, it's one thing to have length. It's another thing to use it, and he does it as well as anyone. Nice kick there by Lee. Well, his kicking game was outstanding in that round. We'll see if his opponent can make the adjustments, but take us through the replays before we get there. It's always weird to watch a young fighter start to come into his own. 
early in his career, he did not have this ability. He did not have the ability to dictate and control fights with his legs. Now he does, and he looks like a future champion in the making. All right, DC, buckle up. Here we go with our next round. High number of kicks landed in the previous round, and he'll look to keep it going here. He'll look to keep winning the fight with his kick. He's throwing eye kick, leg kick, body kick. He's even throwing a couple spin kicks in there. This guy is so educated with fighting with his legs. Sniff that one out as he blocks the kick. His opponent in a world of trouble. Such a sneaky head kick. He did not recognize him. He's going high, and now he's got him hurt bad. Punches in bunches, and he hasn't really shown any signs of slowing down here tonight. I'm not sure how much more his opponent can take. Well, one got through. That kick was blocked. And just inches away from landing one of those big right hands. Whoa! He's hurt. Throws him up. Go get him. Oh, nice high kick. Real sneaky body kick. What a punch. Throws a big right hand, but doesn't find its home. Yes. Oh. oh, nice right hand. Oh, looked like he was trying to set up the head kick, but he misses on that attempt. Come on, push through it. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Three minutes remain in the round. Big head kick lands. Beautiful punch. And both guys really throwing with authority. Ooh, looking to set up the head kick, but he misses. Watch the punch. Well, he has really started to apply a lot of pressure here down the stretch. Not as much offense earlier in the fight. He is making up for lost time now. Oh, big punch land. Slip to avoid that right hand. Oh, thought he might have had that head kick, but just out of range. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. That right hand hurt him a little bit. Came with inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Blocks the shot. Oh, yeah, right here. Lands with the kick there. No pat on that foot. No shit guard. He's taking all of that kick every time he throws it. Oh, nice knee to the body for him there. Very nice. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. Oh, good kick. Well, he continues to find the openings tonight. Beautiful connection with a the punch there. Accuracy oh. at the What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right. Whoa! Whoa! 
Seconds winding down in round three. Oh, that kick is good by Lee. And what a round! All right, so let us now check out some of the action in that round, DC. There was a whole lot of it, including a stunner upstairs that nearly closed the show. It was a lot of action. It was back and forth action, but the big moment was that big strike to the head that landed that put him on wobbly legs and in survival mode. Luckily, he made it to the end of that round. All right, so next round underway here, and you got to admire the stamina that both of these guys still exuded towards the end of that round. Both men put a particular focus on their cardiovascular commitment in this training camp, and it's clearly paid dividends here tonight. We have two legitimately fresh fighters here as we hit this next round. Well, just as he did in the previous round, continuing to land a high number of strikes here, and he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down. Scary, scary proposition for the opponent. Dig and kick. Oh, nice slip there to avoid the punch by Lee. Oh, and he connects with a the punch there, DC. You like this guy. I like this guy a ton. And to watch his punch, I just put a smile on my face. I mean, he's cutting him down to size with these beautiful leg kicks. Back to the jab now, no good. Not there. Big kick lands. Oh, pinpoint knee to the body. If you're trying to knock me out, you put one knee to the body, I'm done. Every time the opponent tries to get close, he just drives that knee to the body. Great timing. And he switches his stance yet again. Lee gets touched by that kick to the body. Nice punch, Lynn. Upstairs. Trying to establish that jab once again. Real quick leg kick. Oh! oh he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go change that finish. Down. Oh, big left. Bonus checks ready. I mean, this fight is about done. He's got him hurt very bad with his head kicks. Now he has to find one more strike to end the night. Oh! <laughs> Lee gets caught with that punch. Not the easiest guy in the world to hit, but he got caught there. Nice, sneaky head kick. Just a slip there. Whoa! He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. Just misses with that one. Left punch is clean, followed by a right. Oh, tags him with the left, so the right hand has been there. Now he goes left hand. When you're able to fight from both sides, you become really dangerous. Right under the elbow, the body kick lands. Trying to hammer that lead leg. Now a knee to the body. Well, that body kick was there earlier, not there on that attempt. Much improved defensively as he blocks the shot. There's no tell on that leg kick. Well, he continues to offer up the kick here, but just misses with that one. Real nice body kick land.
45 seconds remain in the remaining in round four. Oh, looking to land the leg kick. That one checked. Oh, man, hit you land. All right, so there's the end of the round as we show you some of the highlights, DC, and there was a big knockdown there. Thought he might get the finish. We'll see if he gets it in the next round. Well, if he lands that shot again, if he lands that shot again, it will be over. It will be a finish. You don't recover from two of those types of strikes. He found the right moment. He found the opening and landed that big strike. You ready? You ready? Fifth and final round. Some fighters shy away from checking a leg kick. Check that one. Straight punch lands. That was a thudding leg kick. Nice kick landed there by Lee. Blocks that kick to the body. Oh, look at the redness underneath that left elbow. He is badgering that left side of the body. Big leg kick land. Trying to do damage now with the kick. That's a miss. Oh, nice strike landed there by Lee. Flush right hand is true. Just misses with the straight right. Lunges forward with a left there. Back and forth we go. Well, he has certainly found the range and staying pretty busy here on the field. He's being busy, but it's also the timing and the accuracy that's allowing him to land so many impacts. Oh, thunderous leg kick. He's going a little bit, tried to stay upright, but man, that changed the reflection of this one. Johnny's hurt. Hurt really badly by that one big leg kick. Caught that kick there. Three minutes now to go in this one. Good stick. Trying to control posture here. Now trying to hip escape. He's just trying to move out of this position off the bottom. And really starting to make these shots count. All right, working inside the closed guard now. Oh, he gets back up. The question is for how long? Oh, and he connects there. Pretty nice punch there. Great job finding the range to land those punches. Liver kick. Under two minutes remain in the fight. You gotta get this kick now. Lee going for the body kick there, but he misses. No setup whatsoever there. Big punch land. Ooh. 
beautiful body. Another shot lands upstairs. that kick. Oh, and the Superman punch is good. Nice great punch. Forty-five seconds remain in the round. His hands are down. Let's set up that high Lee going for the leg kick. He does not connect. Whoa! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Oh, he might be out. Going orthodox now. I might let you kick the inside of my leg after the show. No. See how that feels. You don't want that, J.A. You do not want that. No one wants uh, that. Even trained professional fighters right. can't take too many of those strikes. You got the turn in that kick. What else can you say but what a fight? All right, so the fight goes the distance. We'll take a look back at the action, but should go his way given all he got done in the striking game. Yeah, he did a great job of landing at will, mixing up the target, doing everything that he's become known for in order to cruise to a very good decision. I know he didn't get the finish that he wanted so bad coming in here tonight, but he had a phenomenal performance, and he showed that he's one of the best fighters in the world. All right, it looks like the official decision is in. Yes, here's Bruce Buff. Ladies and gentlemen, after five rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. All three judges score the contest. 48-47. Declaring the winner by unanimous decision, Bazooka! All right, nice job by him there, as he is your winner via unanimous decision. And sometimes I would think it's easier said than done to just leave the judges out of it dominant performance and he gets his hand raised. Yeah, and if you gotta go to the judges, leave no question, right? Be the person that is so dominant that you know you're getting your hand